Lighting is important because without it, you either can't see at all, or you can see a little, but you're gonna miss the details. Do you ever notice how nighttime photos look so fuzzy and show less detail? It's because there's not enough light. Here's a photo of Sophie sitting on a bed in a very well-lit room. It's a, it's a well-exposed photo. You can see all these different details. You can see reflections in her eyes. You can see her fur. You can see her whiskers. There's plenty of light and lots of detail to be captured. This next photo, what I did was I closed the two curtains in the room and removed the lighting. You can see how much detail is lost in this second photo. You can't see her whiskers as well. The, there's a lot of detail lost in her ears. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison so you can really see the details that are lost. This is another example why lighting is so important. Lighting is also important for storytelling and creating drama. We're gonna talk about placement and direction of lighting and what it does to your subject and the story you're trying to convey. Lighting also flatters. It's so important to know that. When photographing a person, lighting is used to emphasize their most important features, most often the eyes. Start looking for lighting everywhere you go, always. In the room you're in right now, look around and find where the light is. Where is it going? How bright is it? What color is it? Is it coming from a window? A light in the ceiling? Does your computer create light? Is there more than one light source or is there just one? What direction is it traveling from and to? What is touched by the light source or light sources? Now it's time for you to grab your subject and your camera for some practice.